Ooh. Top four. Wisconsin and Minnesota going at it. 2v2. Get get these retweets off. Yo, yeah, let's get, the, let's get this retweets while we're waiting for the players to get ready. Okay, so we still don't have a Minnesota-Minnesota matchup for me to use my fancy new tool. Yeah, and... Sad. Uh, this is just... This is... Fuck. This is such a good tournament. I love it when the out-of-stagers come in and everything just works out fine. I'm not going to get these retweets in. Not unless... I'm just so skilled at this, you know? Now, so the thing that I that Nameless needs a lot of for is Comet plays Marshall. It's been finals. It's been winter semis. They've happened. They played each other. All right. How much did he? How much Fox experience does Nameless have? Quite a bit, uh, but not quite at this level. Is what I would say. Uh, like you know, down for the cause. Yep. Um, we've had other good Foxes like Drubaka and Elder slash Yohan. You know, a bunch of mid-level boxes. It's, yeah. it's not a character like, you know, other than Nameless, we have like no Diddy representation until recently when Absent picked them up. Mm -hmm. and even so, like, it's not quite like that. Yeah. It's not like Minnesota's typical top tier problem. Or how like we almost never have any Bayos entering because Josh doesn't enter. So, wow, that wall, wall jump side beat? Okay. And so, same with Stephen Shard. The problem problem that even I have playing Nameless is that it's not hard. Oh. Yeah. Marshall won't get that. He will not get up there up air kills. Nameless will. He takes the time in, gets the 50-50s, gets those. It's just another thing to look out for. There's an interaction that happened right at the beginning of the game where Nameless just monkey kicked in his face. Would Marshall ever do that? Not the start. He'll he'll only do it if They're there's a ledge cancel. They're just sitting there in, oh. in total neutral, monkey kick in his face. Marshall will do it if there's a ledge cancel. He will not do it often. Yeah, there was no ledge cancel. Nothing even close. So I think that what is often perceived as recklessness by Nameless, I, I don't think that's the right descriptor for it. It's very calculated. You, know, like very you know what I mean, right? Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. Strong like, confirmed from Soul Comet. It's like when you see like Ally or Larry Lurch just go for these really weird options, and it works because some you can't something with the top players like the difference mid-level players you can do everything right, you're still gonna lose. You have to mix it up. You have to do those strange things. Get those hard punishes. Okay. Big forward smash. Oh, I'm really smart with that recovery. Oh, um, Nameless also beat Welker for this box. Oh, yes. Forgot about that. As I run, don't walk. And in the crew battle today. Comet's got something on his mind. It's that, right. was, that was a game five set, so I could I could see this also being very close. And that was the big thing, was stuffing Fox Illusion with Fair. Nameless just missed it there. If you can get one of these, it might be the game. I love walking the banana forward, but he picks it up. I don't think he wanted to pick that up with that Fair. Yeah, he's looking for it. He, oh, Nameless is Fair. The standoff here. One banana confirmed from either of them. Down tilt from Nameless. Would up tilt kill Fox here? Uh, okay, good maybe. Kick. Definitely now. Needed the uh, needed that active hitbox out there. Up tilt will kill now, but oh, he misses the confirm and punishes the air dodge anyway. <laughs> Yo, Diddy Kong's a good character. Yes, seriously. But also great adaptation from Nameless to realize that he had whiffed and get in there. He drifted in for it. Like yep. usually, you can want to drift back, but it's just like, all right, I need this right now. I think that was an exciting game, though. That was These guys explosive. First game loss? No, he lost. No, yeah, that was Real Comet's first game loss. All right, let's see how he responds. Oh wait, oh yeah, two. He lost two, two games to Cookie Kick. My bad. Oh yeah. So it's not his first game loss, but still. Yeah, you've been you've been running through a few opponents today, so yeah. I know what you're getting. At. Good tech. Nameless knows he has to attack or he's going to get at least Absolutely. like 30% there. Oh, there's an, uh, kind of a failed edge cancel there. Or like, he just didn't get what he wanted out of it. I think he like jumped immediately, didn't back it, like didn't drop down, and the up tilt caught out the jump. Oh. Yeah, really trying to stuff these illusions. How has been doing a really good job of avoiding that so far. He's had to. A lot of people. Oh, oh fair got footstool. Him. But didn't get him. Messes up. The drops are real. And that looks like a weak hit of the forward smash. Wow, Nameless. 
I like the idea of going for the dare because of the weight, but Comet went off to the side ever so slightly, and now this is that nair. That nair Set, you cannot rising fair against Fox at kill percent. He yep. will up smash you. Oh, he wanted. I think he wanted up smash. Yeah. Another little lease at this stock. Let's see what Comet can do with it. Maybe yeah, he's trying to space himself out for the illusion back on its stage, it looks like. Oh, okay, I see. I thought it, it looked like I he got it again. Get right. up the ledge, but you're right. Yeah. Comic gonna, Comic gonna live. No, not with the clap. Oh, yep. So close. Yep. I think if he had down smash, he would have killed him. His back hit would have hit. I think Comet's gonna realize this <laughs> eventually, though. He got the clap again. And he's, he's at a such a high percent, too. Now he's gonna eat up tilts. Another one? Going for the illusion. All right, that should be it. All right, down tilt into fair. Yep. But man, as Diddy, you do not want Fox looking to 174 against you. That should not happen. No, definitely not. 66% off of basically like two punishes. Now he's gets more chances, lower percent to do it again. Okay. Yeah, I like him not betting too much on that punish. But he's got to make something happen now. Comet's had a few road up smashes in this top 32 today, mm -hmm. and it's kind of, it's not been great for him. Like, he just, it feels like he's trying to do something else, but it won't even kill in some percent. Oh. There, that's what I mean. Wow, the back hitbox mm -hmm. bringing him back off stage. And the banana was just adding to that coverage. Rising fair again from Nameless. Yeah, now he can't land, but that was a really smart monkey pick. Oh my god. No more illusion. He's doing jump get up. 50 50. Doesn't get it. Hold the banana. That's why he does it. Nice. Okay, good jump out. Yep. Toes. Trying to find it again. Oh, that was scary. That was the opening. Oh, these monkey flips, though. He has to realize. Oh, oh, and he caught the DI. Yeah. 2 0, -oh, Nameless is his favorite. Comet is exciting to watch. Oh, man. Marshall's going up. Comet is really exciting to watch. He's a very. he's He goes for a lot of, like, nair, really safe nares, and they're going to confirm. Mm -hmm. His ledge play has gotten really good lately. He usually gets punished for illusion so much. Right, and his adaptation to Nameless's attempts to punish the illusion have been really good. Yeah. But Nameless has been counter adapting. Uh, man, that one play where he got the banana down and got the two hits of down smash. Yeah. Oof, that Sick. was dirty. And that was the turning point in that game, I would argue. Yeah, yeah. Because Kama, Kama was in the lead for a lot of that, and he was in a good position. But once that got, he went back off stage, took another like. Interesting that percent. Comet is giving him FD. I think Comet likes this because the way Nameless has been playing, especially with his side Bs with his banana coverage, like Comet's able to be able to like mix up and hit his landings, hit and outspace it. Versus Nameless doesn't. He's so not the space on the up. stage is helping. Okay. Yeah. He's not letting Nameless get extra options by having platforms above him to work with. Sure. Oh, and he's probably so used to playing Marshall, who loves playing on platforms. This is Nameless' favorite stage. Yeah. Like, it's a really good Diddy stage, but I mean, I think like this matchup is a very, very like, even, even-ish matchup. And this stage, I think, is a very even-ish stage too. Sure. I think Nameless's banana play, though, the way that he he's showing that he really knows the spacing with Illusion right now. And I think that's just gonna get harder and harder for Comet as the set goes on. Yeah. I like the reflector, but. Okay, he's getting a little bit off of it. Oh no. 50 50. Oh! You got, the, you got the elbow. Yep, by forcing him to air dodge there, made him able to. It gave Nameless an opening to catch that landing. Really yeah. smart play. He's taking so far ahead. This is why Nameless is... And that dare just looks like it's a, a pure style play when he actually hits it, too. It's like one of those, oh my god, I can't believe I let him hit me with that. But no, there's a little more to it. Yeah. That's why Name Nameless has been consistently top two, top three every single tournament here. Absolutely. It looks silly, but... Ooh! Good up catch, smash. yeah. Up smash isn't a silly thing. You do not play with Fox's up smash. Oh. This whole shield smart. Mm-hmm. 
Did he come Not like he's there? gonna get follow ups on that anyway, so. Oh, great power shield. Oh, and the runaway monkey flip back. That's so hard to deal with. But with Banana, he's gonna get punished, but doesn't shield in time. Now, Gameless is <laughs> cheeky. Oh, that Nair was scary. He's lucky he didn't get punished harder. Oh, the cross-up not working yeah, out. Yeah, I'm surprised he didn't throw him off stage. Is it Nameless about to put comment in the losers here? Oh, F got him! See ya! F smash one way, F smash the other way. Nameless in grand finals. Strong 3-0. Really Nameless strong. defending the turf. But this does give the chance. If Marshall wins against Cookie Tick, our next set. Wisconsin team kill. Ooh. Wait, so who we got here? Marshall and Cookie Tick? Marshall, Cookie Tick. And these guys are good friends, too. They are. Marshall will run a Paul Bang tag.